Hi, welcome back to the Cocktail Vlog. I'm Steve the Bartender and today I'm showing you how to make an Aventura. The Aventura is from Bevy & Co, or Bevy.co, uh, the website, and it's an original cocktail of theirs. But before I get started on the cocktail itself, I am super excited to announce that we have just released our cocktail app. It is available on Android at the moment. I'm sorry guys, we can't do both at the same time, uh, but we do have plans in the future to launch it on iOS. I have announced it on Instagram and Facebook and I've been accosted by a few people for not releasing it on iOS first. I'm an iOS user myself. Um, I actually had to go out and buy myself a new phone so I could use my own app. But we've been working on it for about three months. Our developer, Alexander, is amazing at what he does. And we've got heaps of extra features that are planned at the moment as it currently stands it's um it's fairly basic uh, you can view recipes you can scroll through search by ingredients uh, filter by categories and it's it's simple but it's a really cool app uh, you can change your measurements from milliliters to ounces i'll leave a link so you can download it below uh, and you can check out a little bit more information but over the coming months we're going to release a lot of features and also at the moment we've got about 55 of the recipes from the youtube channel but the other 400 plus will be coming over the next couple of weeks to a couple of months. Super pumped. Check out the link in the description below. Okay, so on to the Aventura. The original from Bevy.co. I'm gonna start with Mezcal, 45 mil, 1.5 ounces. Actually, before I put that in, I'm gonna muddle my raspberries. I'm actually gonna follow the recipe. So add your raspberries, there's about six there. You don't really have to go too crazy on the muddling. The raspberries are a really soft fruit. So as soon as you shake them, they're gonna pulverize anyway. Now we add the 45 mil, 1.5 ounces of mezcal. If you want to, uh, if you don't have a mezcal at home, you can change this over to a tequila. And we've got three quarters of an ounce, 22.5 mil of Grand Mania. And a little bit of elderflower liqueur. Does call for Saint Germain. Uh, I'm using Giffords, 7.5 mil, one quarter ounce. I did not like their recipe how they explained that it was the juice of one lemon, no, the juice of one lime and a quarter of uh, one lemon. Lemons and limes change in size, so you, that, yeah. That's not an accurate way of measuring it, but I'm using three quarters of an ounce, 22.5 mil. And one quarter ounce, seven and a half mil of lemon juice. Then simple syrup. Does call for a bar spoon uh, of just sugar, white sugar, but I'll use simple syrup, 7.5 mil, one quarter ounce. Uh, you shouldn't really need a lot of uh, sugar like simple syrup or a teaspoon of sugar because you've got the, the sweetness uh, in both these liqueurs, so the elderflower and the orange liqueur. So I'm gonna add ice to the cocktail shaker and give it a good shake. And straight into your chilled glass. And today I'm being incredibly refined by using a fine scraper. And then garnish with skewered raspberries. And there you have the Aventura. Cheers. Definitely get that smokiness from the mezcal. That's in intensely smoky, but quite smooth. Uh, it doesn't actually taste too boozy, considering there's the, as much alcohol in it as there is. Um, good balance of the, the sour and the, and the sweetness. That's, I think that's the, those ratios have worked out quite nicely. And I love the addition of the raspberries. Some uh, a nice, nice tartness to the cocktail. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Hit that bell button and I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.